Clashes overnight in Martekert and Martuni district, damage to civilians' property in Martekert. Since the morning heavy shelling at Karmir Shuka, Kermizi Bazaar and Tagavard villages. Azerbaijani Ministry of Defense, heavy clashes at Agdir, Fizuli Hadrura Jibrail and Gabadli directions. 2,474 new COVID-19 infections confirmed in Armenia. A meeting of the presidents of Armenia and France took place at the Elysee Palace. Karabakh authorities named 27 more soldiers killed in clashes. Total number rises to 927. A representative of Armenian Ministry of Defense, heavy clashes at eastern axis of Karabakh. Russian Foreign Ministry, there are no reasons to use CSTO mechanisms in Karabakh conflict. 803 new cases of coronavirus COVID-19 infection were registered in the Republic of Azerbaijan, 8 people died. Severe clashes occur in the Kabadli line. Head of Nagorno-Karabakh authorities Arya Karatunyan is asking Putin to intervene and make parties to return to the diplomatic path of conflict resolution. Nagorno-Karabakh EMERCOM, at 1420 Azerbaijani army targeted Karaga village and later Karaga Birdzor road with MLRS grad. Nagorni Karabakh Emergency Services say that Azerbaijani army using military warplanes to bomb Martekert, Ogdara. Ilham Aliyev, Azerbaijani army captured Zalanli, Kurd Marizli, Muganli, and Alagorshag villages of Gabadli region. Ilham Aliyev, Azerbaijani Army captures Dolaner and Banyadli villages of Kojaband region, Dag Tumas, Nusis, Kalifli, Minbashili, Vaisali villages of Jabrail region, Vanadli and Mirzahasanli villages of Zangilan region. Azerbaijani Foreign Minister Jehan Bayramov met with U.S. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo in Washington. Armenian Foreign Minister Zorab Natsakanyan met with State Secretary Pompeo. According to the Armenian media, military points in Lachin region and Garakaha village are being bombed. NATO Secretary General at Jens Stoltenberg, NATO is not part of the conflict in and around Nagorno-Karabakh. Turkey is a valued ally and I also stated that clearly to the President of Armenia. He's involved in brokering between Armenia and Azerbaijan, but at POTUS doesn't reveal if he has spoken to either leader. Trump, we're working with Armenia. We have a very good relationship with Armenia. We'll see what happens. I think really good progress is being made. We have a lot of people living here from originally Armenia. We're gonna help them. Azerbaijani drone shot down at northeast Armenian border.
shelling targeting Kankadi, Stepanakert and Martuni, Hojabund. Tap Karakoyunli village in Jaranboy district was targeted with Smirch missile. Secretary Pompeo, during separate meetings with Armenian Foreign Minister at Z. Natsakanyan and Azerbaijani Foreign Minister at Bayramov underscore Jehan, we discussed critical steps to halt the violence in the Nagorno-Karabakh conflict. Both must implement a ceasefire and return to substantive negotiations. Big fire in Stepanakert, Kankadi as result of shelling. Vehicle destroyed, several civilian buildings damaged, gas pipeline damaged. Unmanned aerial vehicles of Azerbaijan Armed Forces do not fly over the territory of Armenia, Azerbaijan Defense Ministry. Shelling targeted Avataranats village, one civilian injured. From tomorrow, Armenia will start showing maps of military operations in Karabakh, representative of the Armenian Defense Ministry Arts Runhovhanishan. Video shared by at www.modgov's Telegram account under title, Destruction of the Volunteer Groups and Military Equipment of the Armenian Armed Forces in the Kojavand and Fizuli Directions of the Front. Azerbaijan Foreign Minister Jehan Bayramov held a meeting with U.S. President's National Security Advisor Robert O'Brien. Armenian Defense Ministry spokesman, Su-30SM fighter jets are used, but not to the full extent of their tactical capabilities. CCTV footage of shelling of Kankendi, Stepanakert, Nagorno-Karabakh tonight.